welcome back to the channel and today's question what do I use to power up the van Well, a few people have been asking what do I use to power up the van and uh, let me show you. It's this little baby here. The PPT Power Pack. Let's take a look. Well, it might be small, but it sure does pack a hell of a punch. It weighs in at just 1.5 kilos. The measurements are seven inches tall. That's including the handle, six inches wide, and a depth of just three inches. It houses a lithium polymer battery with a capacity of 150 watt hours. It's got two USB sockets, and it's also got one AC outlet socket. So let's have a closer look. Right, okay, let's have a look how we uh, charge this power pack up then. You've got three different options. You've got a power supply plug, which um, plugs straight into the, to the mains. You can charge it up like that. You've also got um, a 12 volt one that um, you can plug into your cigarette lighter. So you can charge it whilst you're on the move if you need to and this one which is an excellent idea um, you can charge it up by solar so you've got a so if, if you've got a solar panel you don't get a solar panel with it obviously you have to buy the solar panel um, separate um, and the maximum panel that you can use is just 30 watt but that will trickle charge the power pack um, and you get all the cables to do it as well, so uh, that's a great idea. Well guys, that's the PPT 100 power pack. Let's go to the van now and see what items it actually charges up. Well, there's just one lead coming out of the power pack, which is connected to uh, this little device here, which is a four port powered USB hub, which I purchased from Amazon for around about a tenner. All four ports are uh, individually switched and light up with a lovely little blue light um, when each is powered on. Yeah, I think I've got uh, four sets of lights, four sets of LEDs in the van. Uh, the first one's here under the uh, footwell, on the dashboard, just under the glove box, and uh, under the centre console, and a final one just um, peeping out from behind the steering wheel. Uh, they look pretty cool, actually. Look really good. The other set is on the back of the tailgate, as you can see, um, just round the tailgate on the inside. <coughs> and um, I've got another set, another two sets. This is the first set running down along one side of the van. These are like the main main LEDs that I've got inside the van. Um, and as you can see, one down there running along the other side of the van so they, they, they're very good uh, I do like them I do like them they are GBs and um, they, they are cool they're pretty good I've also got these two USB fans which uh, help cool the van down in the summer and uh, they also 
get rid of some of the cooking smells if I do actually cook inside the van I don't do that much uh, to be honest but um, they do help uh, waft away the smells and um, the, the USB ones like I say just connect up to the power pack and that supplies the power for them so um, yeah I'm quite chuffed with them So one of the other things that uh, this PT100 power pack is going to be charging up is this 8 uh, litre 12 volt cool box which I've just purchased from Halfords but uh, we're going to do a separate video on that so uh, we'll, we'll take a look at the cool box later on when it's all set up. So, a quick summary on this PTP Power Pack 100. Um, obviously, a lot depends what you're going to be charging up with it. But if you're like me and you're just using it to charge up your camera batteries, your phone battery, and a few LED lights in the van, it's quite capable of doing that. So, um, for the price of 150 quid, it's not too bad at all. It's a, it's a lot cheaper. Than the bigger power packs um, like the Jackeries and the Power Oak ones, but uh, obviously it's not as powerful as that. You get 150 watt hours out of it, which is not a lot, but um, depending what you're using it for, it could be quite capable for a lot of you. So it works for me. A couple of questions. One, am I likely to get something bigger in the future? Well, I probably am. I'm toying with um, getting a, a ledger battery and uh, using that so it'd be a bit more powerful and last a bit longer but uh, I don't think I need it as yet um, so yeah I'll probably would do I probably would get a bigger a bigger power pack uh, but at the moment it's, it's it's adequate for what I use it for how long will it power up the cool box for well <clears throat> that's coming in another video I've not actually set the uh, cool box up yet so once all the cool box is set up and I've given it a good few goes, um, worked out, out what the best way to, to work it out is. Like, uh, I'm probably going to be charging the cool box overnight uh, before I do go. Um, charge it on the way, uh, possibly, and, and yeah, I'm sure it'll be fine. But I'll let you know more about that in another video. So what are the advantages of the power pack well as the name suggests it's it's portable so it's it's easy just to pick it up out of the van take it out onto the campsite with you do whatever you want with it you can also take it out pop it in your rucksack take it out on hikes when you're doing a bit of a hike um it's 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 fantastic for that it's lightweight it's it's no messing at all so that's a big advantage for me and the other big advantage is not knowing too much about leisure batteries. Um, the power power pack, you just charge it up and plug whatever you want into it. So uh, that's the way I've gone on this one. But don't forget, uh, I'm not living in the van. It's not going to suit everybody. But if you're just going out for the odd weekend trip, camping trip, uh, the most I go out, like I say, is uh, three or four days. When I'm filming the festivals, so um, for me it works. So if you've made it this far, thanks a lot. Hope you liked it. Uh, hope you get something out of it. And don't forget, if you haven't already subscribed, do subscribe if you like the content, and you'll see more of it. And hit that notification bell as well, so uh, you'll never miss another video. So from me, Will Walkley, thanks very much for watching, and I'll catch you guys on the next one. See you later. Um, I'm toying with the event. The, the I'm toying with the. I'm toying. What am I toying with? <laughs>